Nico, now that you've settled into life in Liberty City, I was wondering if you could start to help your cousin with the family business. I thought all I'd been doing since I got there was helping you out. You have, you have, but I mean officially. I need more drivers for the cab company. I'll pay you properly. Okay, then. Just call me whenever you want to take a fare. You can do as many as you like, Nico. There are always more customers. Ah, uh, fuck you! You're a bunch of pussies and fags! Nice. I'm going back to the meeting! Good! I'm going to be somebody! Yeah, yeah. See you later, Mel. You always were an asshole, Mickey! Hey, watch where you're going! Hey! Hey! I tried to tell you... Fuck to... you! Excuse me. Позвони мне, когда закончишь, хорошо? So, Ivan, I see you later, okay? Yoko, Fetty Roman's cousin. <laughs> What's your name again? Big Mouth Prick. Very catchy. Sit down. Cousin... Uh... Nico. That's it, Nico. Not Big Mouth Prick. You funny guy. I try. Yes, and this one's. I'll let you take the shit out of me. Take the shit? Yes, me give out. I don't understand. Ah, people who fuck with me get fucked with. Okay, fine. Calm down. Whatever. Some old man not paid me in months. And I'm not kind of person who is treated this way. Old bastard owns a china shop in the Campton Avenue in Dukes. Here you go. Don't hurt him. Just teach him a lesson. I don't need a bat to teach a lesson. Hey, let me in. You have Vlad protection money, old man. Big Vlad and his protection money? I'm so scared. What I need protection from? You think this door is going to save your shop? There's shit I can break out here. Vlad should pay me to tell punks like you to go away. He get no money. Shit, Bray! I pay up now! I pay up! Shit! Here! I thought Vlad and I had understanding. Only thing I understood was you owed him money. Hey, man, don't talk about weed on the phone. Just say you need to order a green t-shirt. Hey, yeah! See you Thank you. 
Hey, Yokel, you managed to do the job? Get Vlad his money? He paid up. I had to smash the shop up pretty good, but he paid. Don't worry your little peasant head about it. Stupid jerk made a mistake of telling me how much he gets that shit for back east. He's the biggest crook in the neighborhood. Lucky I don't tell his customers what they're paying for. That it? Can I go now? Sure. Get out of my face. Okay, man. We go drinking together. I pick you up in next hour. Great, Nico. See you in a while. Fuck this, dude. Nico, good to see you. Let's go. Nico, you do not know how great it is to have you here with me. Before you arrived in Liberty City, things were terrible. I still remember the emails you sent me, cousin. You should have told me how bad things were in this country before I got here. Okay, things aren't easy for us here, but together, we are doing all right. America is an opportunity for a new beginning. You were in need of one. There is no such thing as a new beginning, Roman. With every day we live, we pick up new baggage. Baggage that we must carry with us for the rest of our lives. There's no dropping it and pretending we are fresh and clean just because we get off a boat in a new place. Stop being so dramatic, Nico. Time is a healer. We live and we forget the past. Nothing helps a man forget, like ripe round American titties. You have to move on from the things that happened to you and think about all the opportunities in this country. Chances to make lots of money, chances to get college girls and to bed. Chance de postanesh, Soronia. I heard that. I haven't forgotten our language completely. Old Vlad's bar. Well, we shall see if he can add our drinks to the rest of my debt. I did not meet Vlad in there. I wanted to tell him what a good lawn shark he is. You, if you drink and drive, Nico, you're a bloody idiot. We need to get home. Quick! Are you throwing up, Roman? I'll throw up on you! If you give me any more lip in me. No, I need to play some bets. I'm feeling lucky. You're lucky to be conscious you drunk so much. I have a good feeling in my gut. There's money to be won, Nico. Wonderful dollars to collect from stupid chucks. I can't pick a winner from a loser. A bad hand from a good one. If I was a betting man, Roman, which I'm not, I would bet against you in this state. Oh, that was fun, NB. Hit me up if you want to hang out again soon.
You're going to have your license revoked. What? My friend, smoking in a bar is a crime, plain and simple. Well, you're joking, right? This is a joke. Yeah, you're playing hey, a joke on me. Mallory, I, I can assure tell you Fadig his cousin is okay. He just walked in. Great girl. Yeah? Stay away from her. Ah, of course. Now listen. You did good with the business the other day. But now one more peasant is trying to avoid pain. Who? Moskovsky jerk who owns the laundry in the Masterson Street. Thinks in this country business is done differently. Says he will call cops on us. Okay. So? Jerk needs to be taught a lesson. Give him a beating. Let him know might is right. Hey! Stop that smoking back there! Bushel! Easy, Wait. buddy. <laughs> Go on. Do what you gotta do. But remember, you see a cop? You don't know me. I see anyone, I don't know you. Ho, ho. Hello. Vlad говорит. Да, да. Что ты хочешь? Быстрее. Я очень занят. I have a message from Vlad. Shit! Stay away from me! Okay. Why have you not paid Vlad the money you owe him? I'm going to. I've just been having the trouble getting it together. Vlad is an impatient man. You will be getting the money to him soon, or your wife shall be using your washing machines to get blood out of your clothes. Do you understand? I do not ask twice for a favor. I understand. I will get it to him. I thought this country was different. I spoke to the laundry mat owner. He gets the message. He will pay you now. I like your style. You can be an intimidating guy. It's a shame everybody knows what a stupid yokel you are when you open your mouth. Huh? Get back to the marshal. be very useful in this city.
So she sends me out to the store. Hey, Frank, where are you? Where can I get some? Oh, Yoko, there you are. Okay. Glad. Come on, let's go for a walk, okay? Right. Okay. Come on, okay. Come on, 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 come where are we going? To my car. Why? Because of your cousin. What? Owe me a lot of money and until he pays me, you're fresh off the boat. Excuse yeah, your ass is mine. What the fuck you mean, why? Hey, you are a pretty relaxed guy, huh, Vlad? Come on. Panovinsky, Starai Vedmak. Come on, Yoko. What's wrong with you? You gonna jump me? No, I had a late night last night. Spent it with Mikhail. Great. Yeah, wild. Yeah, I guess you're right. So who the hell is Mikhail? Mikhail's a man. Shit, my nose is bleeding. Is my nose bleeding? No, not yet. Fuck this. Come on! Wait! I'm walking hey, here! Wait the Let's fuck go! Up. Damn city, always trying to run you down, huh? Hey man, can I borrow Get dollars? a job, hey, you deadbeat crackhead! Just a little change, man! Man, hey, where do these people whoa, get off? Like I'm gonna pay for their drug habits. Well, say something! You are so fucking laid back! Warren! Come on! Want some? Good. We walked all the way over here so you could snort coke? No, listen! Ah, oh, that's better. Huh? That's better. Man, Michael gets the good stuff. It's got some laxative in it, though. Keeps your stomach proper. <laughs> nice detail. Yeah, listen, huh? Where were we? I don't know. Oh, yeah. So, I need you to head up to Dukes and get a car for me. It's a silver blister, and it's packed in the projects by EIC subway station. Okay? Sure. <laughs> you yeah. got keys? Uh, no. Yokel, I need you to take the car. Asko owes Mikhail some money. Take his car instead, huh? <laughs> we gonna drive over there? What? How are we gonna drive over there? No. You're gonna take the train, buddy. You think I wanna be in the car with the peasant? Come on. I'm gonna go meet somebody. <laughs> Have a little <Okay>. party. <laughs> Fine. Bye, Have fun, bye, bye. dickhead.
This car belonged to Vlad. No, it's mine. Who asked it? He belongs to Vlad now. You should pay your debts. You that fat Russians, bitch? Just try and take. Come on, keep it high. Uh. Let's keep it high. Son of a bitch! Nah, B, you ain't running shit around here. I'm from the D borough, son. I'll fuck you oh. up. Uh. Uh. Nah, Don, you ain't styling on me. You wanna go hand to hand, Kiko? Come on. Uh. Whoop that ass, Dunny. Word the Miz. Vlad. It's not pretty though. Real dirty. Dirty? I can't sell a dirty car. I know your cousins like them dirty. Maybe your whole yokel family drives around in a dirty car, but it's not the way over here. Fucking peasants don't do nothing right. Hey, I could fuck this car up worse than a little dirt. Relax, man. You should lose your age. There is a car wash over on Saratoga Avenue. Just take it over there, and then to my lockup, just a mohawk. Did they give the car up easy? He was reluctant. He's dead now. Stupid bastard. At least I got my money.
Put the car in your locker. You're not as stupid as you look, young. Come back to see me at the parcel. serve you? Here you go. Binge away. Thanks for helping us make food fast. doing hey Mickey what do you have glass of water glass of water bang bang you are dead wake up you moron you got me come over here sit down you remember Ivan no guy you saw me talking to this guy uh this guy. Oh, yes. You guys had the little kiss. Very funny. What would you say if I told you he was going to rap your cousin? I'd say, what problem has he got with my cousin? Hold on. Hey. Hey, hey, gorgeous. No, I can't talk right now. What are you wearing? No, I mean underneath it. Great. Listen, I'll call you back, huh? Sorry. Who was that? Never you mind. Was it Ivan? Ooh, that's funny. You know, for a dumb yokel, you're a very funny guy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and for an annoying dick, you're really an annoying dick. Well, it's a real shame, then, that I'm the guy with the powerful friends, and you're the little punk whose only friends is some fat weasel who drives a fucking cab! So, why is Ivan going to rob my cousin? Because I want you to kill him. What? He's angered Mikhail, Mr. Faustin. Offended him. He think he's stealing some paperwork from her mom. You catch him and kill him. Then we say it was just a robbery that failed. And what if I say I don't want to be your hitman? <laughs> that Mr. Faustin will be very angry with you. And your cousin. Hmm. Okay. I knew we would understand each other once I put it in this simple way. Now! Go wait for him by the car depot. Hey, gorgeous. Yeah, where were we? Okay, now listen. Let's talk about tonight. this. I wasn't sure about killing you when Plan S. Now I'm coming around to the idea. Shit! 
thought everyone in this country was fat and slow. You trying to rob my cousin? Vlad's a bomb, he set me up. Vlad don't like you no more, man. There's nothing in this town. Don't do this for him. You're a fast one, aren't you? Ah, there ain't nowhere left for you to run. Please! Vlad told you to kill me, right? I wasn't stealing nothing from your cousin's place! No one's going to know that I'm alive, not even my mother! I'll stay out of Hove Beach. I'll be a ghost. I promise. Please! Vlad told me to go there. Let me go and I'll lay low. I promise to deal with you. I don't break promises. Ivan is dead. He came to a sticky end. Hey, you and your cousin's girlfriend should get together. She likes sticky finish as well. Fuck you! Say that to my face and I will break you! Come on, tough guy, get out of the car! Oh, no. I do shit to deserve this! How you doing? Good. Thank you very much. <laughs> good. Yes, comrade, I am doing good. There is no I, there is only we. <laughs> it is a glorious system, comrade. <laughs> excuse me? You're excused, comrade. You're excused. Now go and mind self for 50 years. <laughs> You're a dick. I'm a rich dick, friend. I'm young and rich and loaded. <laughs> Tell you what, have a hundred bucks on Uncle Sam. Benjamin motherfucking Franklin. Freedom! This coke is okay.
cousin. You wanna go shoot pool? Sure, cousin. We play some pool. I come get you in next hour. Great, Nico. See you in a while. Let's go. Nico B in the house! Man, sometimes I cannot believe you are here with me. Really, I can't. It's hardly been a lot of fun since I turned up, cousin. Correct. It has been a fucking nightmare, but that's not the point. No? No, the point is, fuck it. The Balik cousins are here in a land of opportunity, and we are making trouble for any fools who get in our way. If you say so. I do say so, man. I do. I just did. It, it's good to have you here. Whatever shit we get into, man, it's good. Thanks. Don't you miss home? You've been there a long time. You never get homesick? Sure. I miss things about home, but I, I, I think things are ruined now. Yes, I know what you mean. I miss the good times we had as children, when our fathers were too drunk to beat us, when there was food and the sun was shining, but now, now I live here and life is good. Is it? Yes, cousin, it is. Sure, this place is crazy, but so is home. And here it is okay to be an eccentric go-getter businessman with a taste for fine women, wine, and song. Is that how you see yourself? Yeah. My god, you are deranged, cousin. This place has made you sick. Fuck you. I'm an individual, my friend. One of a kind. Or, to put it another way, a freak. There's only one thing I'm better at than playing pool, Nico. And as a man, you won't get to see me in action. Careful. I read bread run. Go on, Nico. You break. Unlucky!
What a surprise! That's a tragedy. Shit! Now try to do it again! That's in. Well played. For a loser, this is a remarkable run of good luck. You missed, you dick! Surprise! Well played. Want to play again? I'll break. For the first time ever, Nico Bellic mishandles a strange ball.
think that's a foul. Incredible! It went in! You missed! I parted one. Sit down, loser. I will get the hang of this. Loser. Damn. Shit! Lucky! Great!
I will get the hang of this. You didn't mean that! Nico, I loved Mila Tadek, and she loved me! Not quite what I had in mind. It's got to hurt! You never were any good at pool. Want another game? I'm sorry for beating you, cousin, but I'm the better player. Soon that come. is it. Take me back, won't you? Later, Nico. Give me a call sometime, okay? Hey, Michelle, it's Nico. Are you doing anything? You want to meet up? Yes. I'm not doing anything interesting. Pick me up in an hour. Great. I'll see you in an hour.
Hey, Nico. Let's go. Good for you to wear the same outfit. I like it. How are you settling in? Slowly. Your country is strange. Uh, your city makes people crazy. How's Roman? Okay. He likes to gamble, though, doesn't he? I don't know about that. Mallory said he was in debt to some criminals. Do you know about that? No. That would really scare me. Organized crime, I mean. Me too. Do you think they'll try to involve Roman? I don't think Roman would make much of a criminal. I guess not. Interesting weather, isn't it? Very. It's your turn first, Nico. Now you're in trouble. That was good. Game. I will get the hang of this. You did good. Hey, you sunk one. My shot. Thank you. 
Oh, you potted a ball. That's in. Jeez, Nico, take the shot, won't you? Next time, I will get it right. Pressure is on. Good for you. Why don't we play again? You want to break? Well done. Nice one, Nico. You fouled, Nico. That was good. Shit.
Too bad, Nico. I parted one. You did good. Oh, too bad. You've nearly won! I will get the hang of this. Hey, you won! How about another game? Peace and love! Well played. You're great at pool. Okay, call me.
are you doing? This is so much fun. You know, Roman, I haven't been having that much fun since I got here. Has been a lot like hard work. Well, you should hang out with your cousin more often. Maybe that is the problem. <laughs> I'm sitting here with Brucey. Well, we're sitting here and calling the cops and watching them show up and look around. They're fucking stupid bastards. You shouldn't cry wolf, Roman. Who knows when you really need help? Fuck! I think they see us. Have to go, Nico. <laughs> 